Hello, and welcome back. My name is Xenon Knight 75 your friendly neighborhood tank. Continuing with the Eden Raid series, let me be your guide through these encounters with the next raid, Eden's Gate Sepulchre. Damn, boy, he thick! Boy, that's a thick ass boy! Damn! Voice of the Land is a room-wide AoE that's unavoidable, just heal through it and you will live. Stone Crusher, aka the Tank Buster, will apply a physical vulnerability debuff on you as well as the Buster has a small AoE, so move away from the tank, you positional damage dealers. Evil Earth will mark one tile to explode, causing a chain reaction to a, the adjacent square. The first tile that explodes will be the safe spot after the explosions, so get your timing down. Weight of the land targets a variety of the tiles. If you see them glow, just move to an area where you don't see the ground glowing. Crumbling Down summons two stones to land on either sides of the arena, damaging you depending on how close you are to the proximity markers. Find the furthest spot from both to mitigate the amount of damage. Once they land, one will start to glow, showing it will deteriorate. Hide behind the one that isn't glowing, as the Titan is setting up a Seismic Wave. Seismic Wave is an AoE raid buster leaving the only safe spot behind the boulder. Side note, make sure when hiding it's within line of sight of the Titan to be safe. Geocrush is a random leap somewhere on the map causing a room-wide knockback. Just position yourself accordingly with arrows to be safe. Careful not to align where you can get knocked off. Titan Fist Phase makes our friend here transform into a boxer that will slap you into tomorrow. Massive Landslide will activate after a short duration causing anyone on the sides of him to be blown off the map, leaving the only safe zone in front of him. Or if you get stuck on the side, anti-knockback abilities will work. Bomb Builder will spawn rocks in a set pattern around the arena. The group will eventually notice the rocks glow in different segments indicating an explosion sequence. Find the area that is safe, usually one of the corners. Be careful of Cobalt Bomb, which the Titan tethers to one of the rocks making it much larger and hurt way more. Titan Wheels Autobots. is a forward Roma. nitro boost movement that will propel players away from the boss, so be standing on the side with the two rows of tiles open. Otherwise, you're going to be knocked off. Titan will continue to do dash forwards. Areas lit up in blue are explosions that are on a delay, so time your frogger movement accordingly as to not get clipped. Earth and Fury inflicts unavoidable room-wide AoE damage with a 15 second dot on everyone. Just heal through it and you should be fine.
Thank you for watching. My name was Xenonite75. If you enjoyed or found this video helpful, feel free to leave a thumbs up or subscribe. If not, that's fine with me. If you're interested in joining me and watching how I get these videos, or just want to say hi, follow me on Twitch at Xenonite75. If not, that's fine with me as well. Again, thank you for watching, and I hope you have an awesome day.